Hello everyone, and now we continue with the next session in the Builder module. We go with the well and recurrent module. So, actually, when you would like to consider about the well and J3, this is the connection between your well producer on gesture to the reservoir formation, right? Before this session, well, and recurrent is the real mechanics. You can see this icon will always get a thicker green color like this. Because actually this option is optional for you. When you have consider about a subsidence in the in your reservoir, or you have the data about the chest and train and the other information related with rock mechanics or real mechanics. You can decide and go with this module. In this tutorial, we don't try to consider about the real mechanics effect, so we ignore this module in this uh, tutorial. But in the in the future score, I will decide to make about the real mechanics modeling for you to more understanding about this option. Now we back to the well and recurrent. Firstly, for well and J3, this is the mass data of J3 can be embarked directly by the builder in the different format. So that you have this data from the base shell software, and easy way you just export from base shell and you can import to CMZ. It's just, it's very convenient for you, right? And uh, well perforation. There are two options for you as well. For web operation, you can consider to make the web completion from the base shell or the local model. Or you can make the perforation directly in the CMZ. It is easy option for you. So for well perforation in the builder, the history of perforated of interval can be added to the J3 a well. It's very convenient when you clean between the JG3 data and perforation in the one single format. The kind information will be related with the typical survey data when you make the exploration, the real link go set, make some measurement data between the measure depth and two vertical depth. At the same time, the real link engineer will make the design for well well reeling so that totally depend on the well engineering so it's not so difficult for you we just buy on or reliable on the well data and you embark to the builder so now we continue with important session production and ingestion data when we talk about this data it related with the history march in your set when your model or your field start to review for several years, they make the record for production data, oil production rate, measurement ratio of the bottom horn ratio as well. By the well and recurrent builder, this format, the format to embark for CMZ is very diversity, so that the state file, the SO file. So I can say the builder make the robot file for you to consider about the input file in terms of production and injection data. Actually, you can generate the kind information about one of the specialist software about oil field management. We usually use oil field manager to manage the kind of data, right? So the easy way after you got the data from oil field manager, you can handle any number of producer on the well by on the history year. I can make a note here. Even though I talk about history code year, but you can define by day, month, or hour. It defend your record data. Personally, they try to make the average production on monthly basis, right, or daily basis. So, don't 
worry about the kind of information. Whatever your data is from a day, year, or month, it will be easy to import to CMG. Because in CMG, they consider a database for corruption and injection data. When your data import to Builder, they will convert to FS F price. And it's very convenient after you conduct the simulation from IMS, JM or STAR, they can convert directly the measurement data to compare with your simulation result. Based on the function, you can easy to observe whether your simulation already match or fitting with the uh, mess with the simulation data or not. So it's very useful for it to match in your set and the kind of information we will consider in this tutorial as well. And now we would like to continue the web chain for your model. If we talk about the web chain, it usually support for the history matching or reduction, reduction for the future of your well or uh, reservoir performance. If I talk about the Lewis oil or gas ray, oil, you can consider about an injection ray, motorhome pressure, warehead pressure, on the target to modify the constraints. This kind of information is very useful for you when you would like to control or monitor for your field development land or you can maximize the oil production ray by an information. And the other advantage of builder, you can embark directly the wear model from the other commercial, commercial software, such as Rosberg, Bysim, or other wear ball modeling software. You can consider if you have the kind of information from the software, you can easily to embark to the builder. So we continue with the net function of the wear recurrent. We can group. In the builder, you can control corruption or injection by roof. And now there are some options are available for you. So that the silent, silent roof. When you would like to make the water alternating gas go set, you can decide how long for your water injection or how long for your gas injection as well. So the function is very popular and it is commonly used for WAG process using group function. And also in the same time, you can want this relayment in the group function as well. And also the injection and corrosion ray per group, or if you would like to make your corrosion ray in the static value, you can control the information by group. Or you would like to make your reservoir maintenance to make your your production is more efficiently, you can use the root control for pressure maintenance. Also, the recycling option also useful for you when you will look at about the trigger, the alternating gas or polymer or water injection as well. The kind of information is in low or comprehensive about the wave and recurrent. This is the final session of the wave recurrent. And beside that, uh, in the wave and recurrent, we have, have the viewing riser. When you would like to consider about the rupture, the function is very useful for you. So that you would like to decide the line of rupture, the complete rupture for your more reservoir model. The kind of option can help you to modeling the rupture process, or even you can import or enter the data manually by on the micro seismic data as well. Usually, the kind of information you can use the third party software, row firm, they are very popular for rupture and micro seismic data as well. Also, you can consider about the non dac option, such as the Frederick and Ray First correlation, the kind of information you can perform in the built-in wiser. And about the hydraulic structure well, 
I will try to introduce for you when we go with the hand-on exercise module in the final session of my course. So, that's all about the uh, builder. The next video we will introduce about the IMS application for you to have a good overview about this software. Thank you for your attention.